So I'm gonna do a little bit of post-game commentary here. Uh, basically, here I curse myself. This is a solo curse strategy where you can put the curse pot on top of two skeleton blocks and have the curse pot fall on you. You get damaged by the skeleton blocks, curse pot hits you while you're stunned, and then it breaks. And then to rob gist shop, you just move all the presents to the right, break them, make sure to pick up stuff as fast as possible so gist doesn't hit you. And when you get uh, through the door, you'll have iframes. And so the run looked like it was going to go really well. Um, all I needed to do was get uncursed. I needed to sack two dogs, right? I make it to the next floor, and I see the moon challenge. Easy, right? We're going to get a uh, bow. I go into the moon challenge, and immediately, what do I see? The bow and arrow right next to the entrance. I go to pick up the bow and arrow, but what I want to do is just finish the moon challenge fast, and so I move this block in preparation to crush the matic. I move it again, and I think, hmm, I'm gonna get stuck. So I'll have to bomb, but I get crushed by walking into the gap between the block and the other block. Um, apparently that counts as a falling push block because it's not completely flush with the ground. Uh, have you ever been in this situation before? <laughs> Almost 98% of my viewers aren't subbed. That means they haven't decided if they want to see more of me yet. Take your time getting to know me, and I promise to upload regularly. Maybe you'll like what you see.